Hi, I'm Nana, and you're watching Team 5 Minutes Real Talk. And today we have Coach Roseanne, who is a nutritionist, fitness, and lifestyle coach. Welcome. Oh, Nana, thank you so much for having me. It's such a pleasure and such an honor to be here. Thank you for having me. Thank you so much for coming onto the show oh. and also thank you for everything that you've done. I know we're going to be getting into that. We will. A personal thank you because I am feeling and looking fantastic. Can I just tell you, you look amazing, Nana. And just the way you're feeling for me, that for me is more than anything. And I thank you for just being coachable. And I thank you for the steps that you've taken. Because only you make me look good. <laughs> you really you do. You make me look good. You make me look good. But, but you look fantastic and I'm so proud. And I can't wait to share your story. I know. Ah. It is just, it is one, two. And even let's go back. Yes. Because um, I know I got in touch with you a couple of months ago. Yes. And um, the one thing that I really thought was fantastic um, because you know I've I've done the yo-yo -yo dieting I've done all of that and it just as you know yes um, and as everybody knows it just didn't work mm. and so getting in touch with you and I know I had a few excuses at the beginning I'm like I'm moving house I've got to do this I've got to do that and I was expecting you to be really harsh and be like it's either now or never <laughs> forget it it's not happening and I actually when I came off the phone I was like wow because you were like you call me when you're ready yes and, um, and that's what happened. When you're making a change or you want to shift and you have all these things going on in life, it's going to be hard for you to focus. So it's like, when you're ready, girl, call me. We're going to do this. And we and did it. And we did it. And I mean, you I, did it. I did it. You I did, did it. it. And I'm actually even still surprised that it's, um, well, I'm actually not surprised anymore because I'm, <laughs> I can look in the mirror and I feel great. You know, and I think maybe at the beginning, let's even, like we say, the whole thing about feeling good. Yes. What is it about? Nutrition, feeling good, and also a little bit about yourself and what you have achieved. Right. So for me, Nana, the way I started this journey was my own lifestyle struggle. I had yes. high cholesterol. Mm -hmm. I was medically obese. And it, it really just became a passion. Mm -hmm. um, for me, I changed my career trajectory, went back to school, became a certified nutrition coach, certified fitness coach. And that's what I've been doing for the last 10 years. So what I do is I help empower my clients to make their best choices for themselves, for their lifestyle. I specifically work with busy women and moms who are looking to lose fat and become healthy for themselves and their family. Okay. And so when you called me, you're a busy executive. I was like, you know what? She's busy, she's moving house. I know how to do this. Like in my, I know, yes. girl, yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you know, I'm not to the well. horn, but I, I, I know how, to, I, I, I'm a, I think I'm, a, I'm an okay coach in the fantastic. sense that I understand. Not you think, you are fantastic. Yeah, I understand my clients and I understand if you have a busy lifestyle, I know how to approach that. Mm -hmm. So when you said you are busy, I said, you know what? First finish up with that. When you're ready, come, let's do this. Then you call me back and you're like, I'm ready. I'm ready. Do you remember you sent me two pictures? Yes. The first, the first one in February, <laughs> then you sent others. And even then you had still made some progress, which by the way, I was proud of. I was proud for you because yes. it's like, she's in the back of your mind. I could see you wanted to get somewhere. And exactly. so then we started the journey. We did. Yes. And I have to say it was, you know, I had, I had, um, after three children, you know, two years in between each of wow. them. Uh, and again, I have to say my diet was out of the window. I was the type that I was probably your typical, your best typical revamp mm. type of person you could mm. use because um, in the morning I would get up, I wouldn't have breakfast, right. be in the office, cups of coffee, probably not even have lunch. Um, and to be honest, like, you know, um, I, I was even telling you that and then I'd come home wolf down two packets of gummy bears right? and then go back to sleep, black out and do the same thing again. Yes. And it was heavily loaded with sugar. I am a very sweet tooth. Yes. And I know when we started and we're doing the, at the beginning, I said, let's, let's try the hay sugar. Right. Because you've got your hay sugar program, program. which is yes. a six weeks, yes. no sugar right. off of it. And I remember now we were in, you know, we're also in COVID and you were like, well, actually, you know, and I said, look, I've got time. Right. So, and you asked me a very key question. Mm. What is it that you want? Yes. Um, do you want to just lose the weight or, and I said, no, I actually want this to be a lifestyle. I've yes. actually got time to be able to do this. So you were like, okay, this is how we start. Take the pictures, yes. one week of assessment. And I was right. like, oh my goodness. I'm like, <laughs> and you were like, and you were saying, just be honest about it. Yes. So anytime I had a gummy bear, I took a picture. Right. <laughs> anytime I had my pasta with cream, took yes. a picture. And then after that, you know, you, you did your assessment. You told me this is happened. Now we're going to actually start. Do you remember when you sent the pictures? Um, Cause you, you used to, how many meals would you have? Could you let folks know in a day? 
one maybe right if i could go like a day two yes, days without, without yeah. food and i remember asking you is this all the food you've eaten yeah, today exactly exactly and you're like exactly. yes it is yeah and i remember thinking okay okay i think we need i could, I could see where we needed yeah. to make changes and where we needed to improve so i loved when you shared that with me and i was like please don't change anything let me just see exactly what you do what you eat but the other thing we talked about was how you are feeling. Yes. Right? Because I said I need you to assess Insomnia, how you're feeling. Insomnia. Yes. Feeling sluggish. Yes. I mean, I was a whopping 78 kgs. Girl. And like mm. I was saying, you know, I think also the whole being in your right space. You yes. Know, weight is not a number. Yeah. It is what you feel comfortable on you. And, and how are you? you fe- yes. And how about. are you feeling before when you're at that, in the initial stages? Not good. I mean, yeah. it's that thing of, you know, breathing in, yeah. off to the side dark colors yes. you know really covering Aww. up everything arms yeah. always wanting to be in the middle of the picture so people could hide you um and i mean i came from you know before my kids i was a what was it 36 24 36 right. you know those, i remember those, those numbers like 36 24 36 yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly and yeah. i said okay i don't want to go back to that right. but definitely want to do something and i yes. said you know and the remarkable thing was i said okay what about the gym do i have to get into that yes and you were like we're not going to start with gymming now. Yeah. Let's first start with your diet, getting that in order. And master that. And we did, you know, a good, uh, after you, after I showed you my food, did all of that, then we started. Yes. May 20th was the starting point. Look at that, May 20, May 2020, yeah? I know, That's exactly, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. I think, let's have a look and see. Yes. The before and after. And honestly, oh, this is amazing. That is such an amazing transformation. Exactly. Look at you before and look at you now. And who were you before now? Well, I think, you know, the beginning part when we had how I was at the start, when right. it says the start, um, I mean, I always make reference to Neanderthal. Yes. You know, I was slumped Aww. over, all of that type of yeah. stuff. Then if you look at the middle picture, which was actually four weeks yes. later, yeah. I had gone from 78 kgs to 67. Mm. Only on sugar. Wow. Only on sugar, not eating sugar, yes. meaning that. Yes, yes, yes. And yes. then if you look at the third picture, and I know that's what you also said, after you've lost your big bulk, you then start losing your inches. Yes. So the third one now, which is the 12 weeks, mm. that is now where I'd now dropped to 64. That is where I am now. Love Today, it. feeling fantastic. Looking fantastic. Looking fantastic. And eating whole foods. Exactly. I think that's key to mention. So you dropped all the sugars, yes. a lot of the refined carbohydrates, yes. and we swapped that and you started eating, what did you start eating? A lot of rich, protein. nutrient, dense foods. Nutrients, yes. Yeah. Protein. Lots of vegetables. Yes. And again, even when people ask, because again, they're thinking, wow, okay, if you're losing all that amount, yeah. you're eating nothing. You're eating the rabbit food that they eat, right. so yes. to speak. But it's not, I mean, because... I have, I can have chicken breast yes. for breakfast yeah. with avocado, right. with cherry tomatoes, with my onions on the side. Oh, can you tell them, the, you know the one I love and I actually started eating is your, the, the, the meal that you do with your purple cabbage, the carrots, the cucumbers, the, the rainbow salad. Oh, the rainbow salad. I love yes. that salad of yours. It's beautiful. That one, I, I really do also really love that one. And even from that, I just named it rainbow because there's everything it's in everything there. It's everything in there. All the, the red colors. cabbage, yes. you mentioned the carrots the tomatoes, I had a little bit of cheese sometimes. Yes. And then also as we were moving forward, because again, I'm also bulking up with the protein. Yes. And I remember yeah. with that, I was now like, coach, I'm really worried because yes. I had done some protein yes. shakes before yeah. and that got me to the 78 <laughs> kgs. And you were like, no, it was the sugar in that. It was. So again, we introduced um, the scoops of protein, protein yeah. powder. Yeah. Um, with that, I'm going to take about 70 grams mm. or more a day. Mm for that, which has really helped. And yeah. explain that part of the protein process, what it actually does. So for you, one of the things I recognized was you are not eating enough protein in okay. your diet prior. When you set your meals before, it was a lot of refined carbohydrates, a lot yeah. of sugars. So that was the bulk of your of your meal. So I, And then we also are working to help you reduce your sugar cravings yes. and help reduce your um, help reduce your sugar cravings. And I'd also felt strongly, once we start adding all these rich nutrient dense foods, you're gonna change your palate, you're gonna get fuller longer. And because we're looking to lose fat, it was important for you to add your protein. So I said, Nana, it's important for you to have protein every single meal because one of the things with protein, it has two things. There's a lot of people who think, oh, protein's gonna 
Make me bulk up, which you had yes. mentioned you were nervous about. <laughs> Very. But I said, don't be nervous about it. But protein is actually one of the best macronutrients that we can add in our bodies, especially if you're looking to lose fat. Okay, no. so explain that process a little bit so Absolutely. people understand exactly. Yes, yeah. So basically, we have three macronutrients. So you okay. have carbohydrates, you have protein, and you have fat. Yep. Our body type, especially, because I focus on people who are looking to lose fat, mm -hmm. generally is what we call the endomorph body type. Okay. So with your body type, an endomorph, which also I can be when I am not conscious of what I'm eating, mm -hmm. it basically puts you, you end up storing more fat. Okay. Okay? Yeah. So one of the things I help you focus on is two, is two things. Number one, release, um, reduce the amount of fat, and we're going to do that by... Re what I call moderating your insulin intake. Yes. And then number two is increasing your protein and your fiber. Why do you want to do that? Several reasons. Number one, protein has been shown to help satiate you, meaning keeps you fuller longer. It's also been shown to help reduce your cravings. Then when you add your fiber or a lot of your vegetables, what that does is it helps stretch your stomach, helps keep okay, you fuller, keeps stronger, full. the fullness, and then keeps you satiated longer. Now, when you do that consistently over time, over time, over time, and also you're adding your complex carbohydrates, like you added your brown yes. rice, uh, you would still have your pasta, which is perfectly fine. Yes, I've actually switched the whole meal. Yes, pasta. Look at that, right? Added the prawns now that I also realized yes. I had a lot of protein. Love, and I love, 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 love. And so when you add the protein, what it does is it helps, number one, retain lean muscle mass. Okay. Why do we want to retain lean muscle mass? As we're getting older, as we're growing older, what happens to us, especially as women, actually generally everybody, mm -hmm. you end up losing lean muscle mass. Okay. You don't want to lo lose lean muscle mass because muscle is what's known as a metabolically active tissue. Yeah. And what it does is it helps uh, retain your it helps you burn fat over time mm -hmm. because it's metabolically active. So it's important for you to have your protein. So that is the key reason was like, I want you to make sure, please have your protein. Then the other thing, if I could just help demystify this, there's a lot of people who are like, like nana, or like protein's gonna make me gain weight, it's gonna make me, it doesn't. Especially for us women, we don't have enough testosterone in our bodies okay. to make us bulk up. What makes us bulk up is a couple of things too. Either you're eating too much sugar and processed foods mm -hmm. or you're overeating. And that's what's going to make you look like you're gaining a lot of mass. But in terms of muscle gain and whatnot, we don't have testosterone, so we don't need to worry about that. So protein's good. No, exactly. Yes. And it is very, very good. And even it the is. way you speak, I mean, like you said, you know, you went back to school, you did all the training, right. you've done all of that. It's passion. And it's not just giving somebody a diet and say, follow this, all of that. No. You know, I'd send you my pictures of what I eat. Yeah. Um, still doing that now, yes. you know, as we're entering into the 100 days yes. for that and really just loving how I'm able to do that because it's, it's subtly consciously there and it's not you're not overly you know forceful about it send your picture in do no. all of that kind of stuff and that's one thing I really love Thank it you. is a behind the scenes type of coach right. and it's trial and error you know because when I send you yes. a picture you also say what's missing from here yes we're going to take a short break and when we come back we're going to have a look and see what your plate should look like welcome back to team five minute real talk and we're here with coach Roseanne yes. and we're going to be talking about what a healthy lifestyle should look like. Yes, 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 Nana. And so that's exciting because now, when you see how you've dropped all this weight, yes. it really has become as a result of who you've become, number one, and what your plate has, how your plate has changed, isn't it? Exactly. Yeah. So what I've loved is how you've made um, whole foods to be part of your lifestyle. And for me, what I've loved is seeing that transition from beginning to now. When I look at your before meals, and then I look at what you're eating now. And what are you eating, Nana? Because I think it's important for folks to hear how you have made it your own lifestyle. No, of course, and, yeah. and definitely. I mean, a lot of chicken. Yes. Turkey, I first started off with comfort foods right. in terms of things that were easy to make. Yes. And so in the first two weeks, I was doing a lot of chicken, either chicken mince, uh, chicken, grilled chicken, mm. uh, BLT, yes, sandwiches. sandwiches. Um, and also another thing, I was also still able to have my cheat meal. Yes. Which is fantastic. So some people call it cheat, some people call it treat. Treat, treat exactly. you know, whatever. With, yeah, yeah, with, with yes, that yes, one. yes. And then moving on now, I mean, in the next, you know, it's been 12 weeks, we're coming up to the 100 days. Right. I'm now having prawns. Again, I know we've got to monitor that because it's also high in cholesterol. Mm. So it's a double-edged sword, but again, being able to do that. And also even substituting now, still adding the, the protein powder to my vegetables. If I'm going to just have a bowl of vegetables. Yes. The yeast. Um, nutrients as well with that. Yes. What's in your gut. Yes. That's another one that, again, you told me about. Yeah. 
uh, the collagen, yes. So a lot of add-ons, side things with that. And also moving away, because I started off with just doing the shakes. Yes. Which was a meal replacement, right. which still worked. I would have, you know, my um, avocado, apple, yes. uh, spinach, add a scoop of protein, add a scoop of um, collagen, add my almond milk, which substitute two milk, or madafu. Yes, coconut, yes, coconut water, water. Yes, 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 yes. And from there now, I'm probably having a shake maybe three times a week now. And, that, and that's fine. And I think the beauty of it is, I always say, try and make it your own lifestyle, right? Exactly. How what do I works make, Yes, what you. works for you? How does this split look for you? And what I loved is, you had a lot of vegetables. That was one of the, you know, you noticed, I kept saying, no, no, I need to see more vegetables, vegetables in here. Exactly. I need to see more of your vegetables. So you were able to put that mm -hmm. in there. And also, I, it's important for me to let folks know, if you can afford protein powder, you don't necessarily have to, exactly. isn't it? Exactly. I always say it's a supplement. If you can get it, get it. Of but course. you can still get this from normal foods. foods. You can get this from normal foods. So you had that. You've had your chicken. You've had your vegetables. You've had your rice. You've had your pasta. Mm -hmm. It's that balanced diet. Just making sure you have whole carbohydrates mm -hmm. in there making sure you have your vegetables in there, making sure you have your fats or your avocado and your yes. olive oil, yes, yes. which I love when you <laughs> throw that stuff in there. So it's really trying to make this plate work for you. But also uh, it's important, don't feel intimidated exactly. when you hear you know, the protein powder or yeah. collagen powder. You can do bone broth soup. Yes. And you get your collagen exactly. from there. Yeah. And one of the things you, you sh your nails, Right? Yes. And your skin, like for me, I'll tell you. So I have wrinkles here. Mm -hmm. But once I started adding collagen, I just noticed those wrinkles started disappearing. disappearing. Exactly. Nails, notice, okay, they're not as pretty as yours. No, 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 it's all good. They're nice and strong. Right? They're, they're, good. they're, exactly. they're super strong. Yeah. But the collagen helps with that. And ex what you talked about is key. Mm -hmm. How do we fix this gut? Exactly. Because once you fix your gut, and you fix your gut by feeding it whole foods, uh, you fix your gut by just adding all these nutrient rich foods, everything else is I'm telling you, it's going to take care of itself. Your weight is going to drop off. You're going to feel you have so much energy, which you... you... Talk about energy your sleep, there. Nana. Exactly, yes. No, and right? also even without with the sleep. And right. one other thing that I really think we have to also even speak about right. is one component that's missing. Mm -hmm. Now, being an athlete from before, yes. all of that type of thing, yes. I, I was not welcome to that. Like I said, I'll go to the gym occasionally. And we only started, I think, after 50 days, yes. halfway through yes. the exercise. Because one thing we also need to let a lot of people know, this is not just done by diet only. Yes. That's where the whole lifestyle comes mm. in. So if we talk a little bit now about the exercises or adding that to, we've talked about the nutrition, we've yes. talked about because you also tailor make it. I do. You tailor make it to a specific person. Correct. You've got your other products, which is the Hay Sugar yes. program. You've got your other, you know, many, many of your different programs right. that um, people can do. Right. Which is, you know, as and it's like a course. Yes. It's like you're taking a university course, you know, one-on-one <laughs> -on -one in, 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 in yes. health and nutrition. Yes, But again, now moving forward, one thing that we've not spoken about that is very key. Yes. Because a lot of people think, okay, fine, it's just only eating and I'm going to lose the weight. Mm. No. To maintain it. Yes. Moving forward. Yes. Fad versus lifestyle. I love the this. The key I component that is now that you have to always use yes. is the exercise. Listen, I love when you say lifestyle because honestly it has to become a lifestyle. Exactly. So we we, we tackled your nutrition, mm -hmm. you've mastered that. Then we added your, your, your exercises and we started with the walking. I was like, don't even worry about running exercises, start walking because I needed you to get some form of exactly. momentum going. And then you started your walking how many days a week? Three days a week. You started with the three. With three days. Yes. And as you moved on, it was five days a mm -hmm. week, just walking. Now, what I want to let folks know is it doesn't, you don't have to do drastic things and change your lifestyle overnight. Exactly. It has to be, it has to be um, gradual. Yeah. Then the other thing which I love is sleep. Yeah. You've got to incorporate all these things. So we have nutrition. You've got to move because our bodies were meant to move. Uh, and you know, we have this Western lifestyle where we're sitting a lot, we're driving a lot. A lot of us are losing a lot of our lean muscle mass because we're not moving and you got to get moving. So the walking is critical. Then sleep, that's how you make this a lifestyle. Someone like you, how stressful can your job be? Yeah. Isn't it? Yeah. So we always say it's important for you to get time for yourself, self-care. Mm -hmm. And for you, you are like, this is my season. I really want to be able to, I, this for me is my self-care. And so once you incorporate all this, your exercise, your nutrition, your sleep, your self-care, this is how you make it a lifestyle. And it's tackling one thing at a time. You don't need to do everything at the same time, one at a time. And then you got to be patient. You got to be consistent. And it's all about balance. 
why do I say balance? Because one of the things is you love your salami. Yes. <laughs> you <laughs> salami, know, and, cheese, and mayonnaise. <laughs> right? And I said, you can have that. We're not saying completely eliminate it, but eat it in moderation. Exactly. So I usually preach balance, moderation, but you've got to be consistent. So it's about the small steps that you're taking every day. And for me, that's why you've seen the results that you've seen, Anna. No, because exactly. you've been coachable, you've been patient, you've been consistent, and you've, you've honestly just trusted this whole process. When I say just let's not focus, because remember you're like, I could do exercises seven days of seven days a week. Exactly. You're like, whoa, <laughs> steady on and see. Because I also figured, you know, you're you've exactly. just come With from the moving, balance, you have exactly, the kids yeah. and whatnot. Like, yeah. slow it down, you're still gonna get the yeah. results. And that for me is what has made it. That's why you've seen the results that yeah. you've seen. You've been coachable, you've been willing to listen to the guidance that I've given you. You've made it your own and it's worked for you. And I'm so proud of you, Nana. Thank you. You have no idea how proud I am. No, of thank you. you. And, and you know, just lastly, I want to, one thing that sticks out in all of this, and um, I get very emotional when we talk about it. And I remember, um, you know, calling you on the phone. Yes. And um, it was at the four week mark. And I remember you were saying, you know, um, do your weigh in, do your check in. And I was kind of delaying it a bit and getting very, you know, gosh, Am I really gonna, is this really gonna have worked? Would it have worked? Um, you know, getting ready in the mirror, in front of the mirror every day, I did kind of see a change, but I didn't, I didn't expect it to be like that. And I remember, um, sorry, I always get emotional when I, no, and I remember calling okay. you and um, I was hysterical. And you know, you thought that there was something wrong. You're like, is family okay? What's yes, going on? We're yeah, in the middle of COVID. Yeah, and I just said, yeah. and I just blurted out, I was like, thank you, coach. Um, you know, it's, it's something that we struggle with. It's something that I have personally struggled with. Um, and, and like I said from the beginning, it was something that I wanted to, um, it's a very personal thing for me. Yeah. You know, it's, it's one thing when, you know, and it's, it's, it's I think it's just a personal, yeah. as when I say a, a people. You know, you've come from being, you know, that um, video vixen or whatever, and I've had the kids and I'm very thankful for that and I, and I would never change that. Right. But, like I said, I was going back and forth with the yo-yo dieting and it just was not working. And I didn't ever think that I would get back on track and it would be this, this easy, so to speak. So I remember calling you and um, I first got onto the scale and um, 78 um, from somebody who, you know, seven years ago was 60. Um, it, 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 it takes a toll on you. It does. And so I remember calling you, uh, getting on the scale and I had to check it again because it read 67 and I couldn't believe it. Mm. And then I remember taking my measurements, yes. um, hips, you know, from a 36 to 41, mm. was able to bring it down to 38 and I couldn't believe it. Mm -hmm. um, and I think for me, you know, speaking to you, and I know we've got a clip of that because um, I've always been doing a video log yes. as well. Yeah. And I just was like, thank you. And I just, you know, as we, as we wind up today, um, it's a very personal journey. Yeah. It's one that I am going to continue. Yes. Um, it's something that fits with me. Yeah. And um, I just want to say thank you, coach. Thank you for getting my hope back. Thank you for being, and you say that word coachable, yeah. um, but being, I don't know if it's, if learnable is a word or, um, Mentorable, yes. that's what mentorable I think would be the flip side of that. Mm. Um, because like I said, I even my kids are like, you know, mommy's back, she's running around with us. She's, you know, I do my walks, I'm incorporating that with yes. them. But on a really serious note, um, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And um... girl, let me tell you, you are so welcome. Um, I do recall that, I yeah. remember the call. I'm sorry for scaring you. No, 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 no. This is good. This is good. I mean, it's, it's important to let emotions yeah. out. Uh, you know, my background is like, I'll let it all out, yes, girl, let exactly, it all out. Exactly, exactly. <sighs> Nana. Sorry. No, it's okay. <laughs> we're good, we're good, we're good. Um, for me, it's just been an amazing journey. Just seeing you transform from who you are to who you're becoming. Um, it's important for me to have, see you take those first 100 days and then we're taking on this chunk to the next 100 days. And I'm loving how you've been taking just really small, they're small. Yeah. But what I want you people to see and everyone who's in Team 5 Minutes to see 
If you are honestly coachable, if you're patient, you don't have to overhaul your lifestyle. Just feel what, do what Nana has done. Taken these small chunks of small, necessary, but very powerful steps. Because even when you're coaching us and you're telling us about Team 5 Minutes, it's all about you're motivating us, but you're telling folks, just take this one thing today. One thing. But if you take that one thing, meditate on what the word, whatever it is, the word that you're sharing with us in Team 5 Minutes, do that. But keep doing it every single day, every single yeah. day, every single day. You will see the results. You will see the changes. And so for me, Nana, I want to thank you. Thank you for being coachable. Thank you for taking the steps. Thank you for just putting your mind into this because you know what you wanted to transform. This yo-yo dieting, it doesn't work. It's trying to find a balance that works for you and that's something that you can be able to maintain. Do you remember that video you sent me? That one week where you said, I'm going to go off? Yes, off the radar. Please, MIA. can you just share that? Yeah. Because I think it's critical that folks get to hear this. And I think the reason why I did that, I was just like, yes. I hope you don't get upset about it or anything yeah, like no, that. No, 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 no. But I had I had done that because I'm, I'm, I'm a sort of person that has to see everything across the board. Yeah. What works, what doesn't work. Yes. And I can get very comfortable yes. very quickly. Yeah. And I'm not unique in that way. Yes. You know, you're feeling good, your body's yes. good, and then you're now wondering, oh, why right. have I now got five kgs back on? Yeah. So I wanted to do the fad versus lifestyle. Correct. So for five days, I went MIA yeah. um, just recently, and it was just to see, is this something that, is it this whole lifestyle that's working? Yeah. Or is it just because I've been at home, I've had more time, I've had a lot more downtime. Right. So for the five days, I tried chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> and I don't even want to see chocolate now. It was a chocolate hangover. Yes. Sugar hangover Sugar the hangover. next day. Yeah. But then again, I didn't exercise. I just basically did everything. I did my old lifestyle. Correct, yeah. Um, and by I couldn't even, I was going to give myself a week. Right. And I couldn't even make it to the, to the yes. week. I was crying to go back. Mm. And for me, that's shown me. I always have to know if you can go this or you can come back. Because what happened in that one week? Because I think it's important for folks to yeah. hear what happened when you did that. For, it was, it was days, what yes. you said. Yes, you yes, know, yes. It's, you've got to take that day at a time. Yeah. You've got to do that. And yeah. it's, it's not just a magic wand and you can continue on and everything is right. great. You've got to put in the work. Right. You've got to work it to work it. Correct. And um, it doesn't matter if you've lost the 12 kgs or whatever, and now all of a sudden you're not going to have it there. Yeah. You still have to keep working the days right. for them, so the weeks take care of themselves, the months take care of themselves. By all means. So that's actually what happened. Yes. You know, it was a this versus that. Yeah. And um, I'm sticking with this. I love I'm, it. I'm sticking with this. <laughs> because you, one of the things you come when you said you're like, yo, my, I felt horrible. My energy felt really bad. Yeah. The lethargy came back, isn't it? Exactly. The, the old lifestyle, the lethargy, being exhausted, feeling. <sighs> Exactly. Like, yeah. 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 And, yeah, no, and it? still not doing anything. Right. 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 You know, so, yeah, yeah. But I think that's very key and very important. I love that as well. And I and what I said was I love that you actually put yourself through that process because it's important. And I, I, there's something about that that I was like, yo, I love what you've done, Nana, because you've compared your current lifestyle, how you're feeling amazing, you're feeling mm -hmm. good, your energy is great. You've gone back to your old ways, and it just didn't feel right. And then you made the choice, and you're like. I'm sticking with this new lifestyle and I love that and I'm pushing you and I'm cheering you on, girl. Thank cheering you. you thank on. you, thank you. And thank you yes. so much for coming on to the show. Oh, thank you for I having me. I really appreciate me. it and I'm sure you're going to be changing a lot more lives. You have been changing a lot more lives thank and I you. hope you also realize that as well. Thank you so and much. And thank you for being a guest here on Team 5 Minutes. Thank you for having me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank and you. there you have it. That is Coach Roseanne. And to find out more about her, you can go onto Instagram at Coach Roseanne and see all of the things that she's been doing and see what program works for you. I'm Nana, and you've been watching Team 5 Minutes Real Talk. And until next time, stay safe.